It's now five days since authorities in Rwanda closed the country's borders with Uganda at Katuna. Over 100 trucks are still stuck with cargo at the border post. In a letter on 28 February, Rwanda Revenue Authority said Katuna was blocked to allow maintenance work. Rwanda Revenue Authority advised truck drivers to use the Mirama Hills Road through Ntungamo to access the country at Kagitumba border post. Now, sources say security has been beefed up on both sides of the border. People living near the two borders are worried of the unusual security presence. Uganda police spokesperson Fred Nanga says the deployment at the border should not worry anyone. What I've told you is the police role in ensuring that these other border points on the, on the Ugandan side are actually safe, secure and, uh, and business, uh, uh, business uh, sustained uh, as usual. He warned those spreading information that Rwanda could have closed its borders due to the alleged arrests of its citizens in Uganda without valid reasons. Rwanda High Commissioner to Uganda, retired Major General Frank Mugambaji, declined to say anything more on the matter. He, however, added thus, and I quote, We have already spoken that the border is not closed. We have explained what is happening at Katuna. We are talking to the officials here, and I close quotes. At the weekend, Commissioner of Customs at Uganda Revenue Authority, Dixon Skateshumba, asked Rwanda to lay trucks with perishables and inflammables get access. We are about 12 trucks of diesel. We had um, uh, two uh, with petrol and uh, three trucks with Jet A1. And these are highly combustible uh, uh, products. We have some trucks which are carrying perishables. Uh, which are stuck there. And perishables have a shelf life, a very short shelf life. He says there is congestion at Katuna border post and the vehicles cannot even get out to drive to Mirama Hills and Kagitumba as advised by the Rwanda authorities. George Abbott Owuma, the chairman for the Parliamentary Committee on East African Community Affairs, called for a faster resolution of the border issue. I'm going to call a committee very soon within this week so that we can also see the way forward. Even bring this matter before the floor of parliament so that uh, the minister should explain actually. Because what we want is a coexistence between Uganda and Rwanda. The Ugandan government says talks are ongoing to amicably resolve the matter. Solomon Kawesa, NTV.